What is going on? I know it's been a while since I've made a video, but you know, life's been crazy for everybody, so it is what it is. But anyway, today I'm going to show you how to make some pulled barbecue black bear. Now, bear is one of those things that people are real iffy about because they think, they think that you can uh, get sick from bear, which you can. You can contract trigonosis, and in short term, trigonosis is worms. But if you cook it right, you don't have to worry about it. Get it up to 160 degrees, you're clear. So, let's get to it. Take you some olive oil, put it in your pan. You want to take each piece of meat, lay it in there, get it hot, you're going to sear it on both sides. Once you've got that done, go ahead and take your meat, throw it in your crock pot, and then go ahead and start getting your vegetables ready. You need some peppers and onions, and I'll show you that in a second. Half a red pepper. Half of a yellow pepper, about, about half a red onion. So you got all that, go right on the top. Take you some green chilies, go right on top, one or two cans, up to you. And I already had some in there, but you want to pour enough in there to cover just about three quarters of the meat. You don't want to completely submerge it. But pretty close. Take it, put it in your crock pot on high, cover it up, and now you wait. Alright, eight hours later. Let's see what we got. I think she's done. Get all your meat pulled. Boy, look at that. That just comes right apart. Yeah. All right, once that's all done, take whatever's left in your crock pot and strain it and get all the uh, juice out of your peppers and onions. Get that drained out. I left a little bit in there just to keep some moisture for the meat. Dump all your meat back in and then put your barbecue sauce in there and you're pretty much done. And that is what, come on, focus, focus! That right there is what I'm going to be using for my barbecue sauce. Use what you want. It's all preference. Don't pour too much. You can always add more. Just put a little bit in there. I don't know, maybe a quarter cup or so. Mix it on up. So you ain't got to add a whole bunch at one time. You can always add more, but you can't take it away. Get a little taste. Oh, man! tell y'all right now that right there's some good shit you try that out you you do this with some bear and you won't be mad about it and you won't know it's bear if you gave this to somebody and didn't tell them it was bear they wouldn't know just put these bad boy on a freaking sandwich take some of that throw it on a piece of bread you talking about a good sandwich that's a good sandwich right there and there you have it make yourself some sides or whatever but that is Pulled barbecue black bear. Barbecue. And that right there is your final product. You can't tell me that no more good. Mm. And that is going to be that for this one. You know, you can make yourself some sides or whatever. I don't feel like it. It's late as heck right now. And I don't. F anyway, this is the end of this video. So, y'all try it out. It's really good. If y'all want to see more, because. I got plenty more bear in the freezer so I can make some more recipes. Hit that like and subscribe button, please. I would appreciate it. And uh, I will try to get more videos out more often. So, uh, peace.